uh, I mean, that's better than nothing, right? That's better than nothing. I'd like you all to see something cool. We'll open that here at the end of this video. We'll open that up at the end of this video. Welcome back to the channel. All right, you all hit well over the 600 likes. Thank you so much. Let's me know that you appreciate it. You were entertained at least. I'm glad someone was. Um, and we still got Nova in the back. Let's see if she is. She is. It looks like a tired puppy. We did go on a long walk. Not, I don't feel like I'm spoiling anything. Because of Volume 2, you know it's because Volume 1 probably did not go well. It was a great example of why this is a terrible, horrible idea. No one should do it unless they're just looking to enjoy that moment. All right. We're going to go. We're doing this. We're going 30. We're going to actually start off with the pop. Then we're going to go to spinning out 20. I really do want Quicksilver badly. I discussed in the Volume 1 why I kind of has it or why I more want Gallon as far as Quicksilver and things like that. And I'll talk a little bit more about why I want Gallon so bad as we open up the Falling 20. Let's hope we see at least two new. At least two new. Let's get them both. Let's get them both because they both clearly are amazing. Man, this is just not the way it's supposed to go. The band is not even messing around. They are like, we are sending all of the good luck elsewhere. We are sending all of the good luck elsewhere, uh, which is cool. Some of you let me know how great your luck was. And let me on this one know. Let me know. Say, like, don't worry, Vega. I got great luck. I pulled them both in two crystals. Things like that. It's fun. I genuinely want other people to be enjoying this game. Okay, let's spin these out. Let's spin these out. Here we go. Whew. All right. I feel like we did the, uh, those are the cleanse crystals. Like Baby Cham says, getting the bad luck out of the way. Six star Betsy, like even just Sim some six star would be fantastic. We've gotten none. Zero. Zilch. Nada. Uh, and Kabam is just telling me, and you will like it. You will get zero, and you will like it. So, Gallon. Because uh, a lot of you have asked. You're like, hey, you know, you were super early on Hulkling, telling us how great he uh, is or was. We've now pulled him from the featured crystal. We get it. We see it. He is amazing. I've taken him to rank three, or I've taken him to rank four. Now that Gallon's in the game, do you regret that? Would you rank them both? You know, where are you? I think both. They are different. They are not the same champion. I know they're both cosmic. I know they both get buffs. I know they hit very hard. I know they both can go unblockable. I know they both can counter Penny Parker. But the fact of the matter is, is they, are, they both, while countering Penny very well, that's not all they can do. That's not all they can do. Uh, man, I'm realizing, like, we're not even getting teases here. I think I saw a quick star, uh, Quicksilver go by very quickly. Uh, Kind of funny that he had Dragon Man, literally anything, please. Kabam. <laughs> that one wasn't even a troll over either. I don't think I can claim that I was uh I was trolled on that one. That was not there was nothing that made me think it was stopping. All right. Huh. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Just shows you. That the more you open, sure your odds increase, but it is, it is incremental. It is tiny. It is not building towards something. All right, here we go. So they are they are different champions. I know they both get buffs. I know they're both going to be problems. I know they both have issues with, um, you know, Teddy. If you try to nullify him, what happens to his buffs there? And then you just flat out can't with uh, Gallon. Uh, and so I think they're both kind of showing, they're exemplifying that shifting relationship, or at least the expanding of the relationship between Cosmics and Mystics. I like that. That's something I look for in Champions as part of why I'm saying, like, I want to kind of go a little bit bigger here for Gallon, because he's also great. Like, if you, sure, you can be the best Penny counter in the world, but if that's the only place I can use you, like, uh, there's other counters. Like, I I'm not going to do that. Um, but he's fantastic elsewhere. I think he's great for the game currently is you know penny counters we really want them um being nullify immune that sort of thing of course the the great damage coming out so quickly out of the gates is incredible but he's also suited for where the game's headed so that's part of why i love him 
This is brutal. And the six stars they're teasing me with, I'm like, you know, I see uses for Betsy Braddock, but I'm not going to try to claim she's an amazing champion in this game. You're not really teasing me here. Like, if you're going to not give me the champions, at least tease me with something better. Have Hyperion come right. I haven't even seen Hyperion. I've been chasing Hyperion. Can't pull him to save my life. That felt like a quick stop. That felt like a quick stop, but it was Mojo, so I'm not going to get too upset. I mean, I love Mojo. I think Mojo's great, but that's not who I'm hunting for here. If it was Hyperion or Gallon, you'd see me distraught. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Nothing, nothing. All right, we're down to our final 10. We're down to our final, final 10. Here they are. Woo! Come on, we need some luck here. We got the lucky hat. Nova's in the back. Let's do this. Okay, we're seeing some six star Quicksilver now. Four star, Mr. Fantastic. All right. Here we go. There's Hyperion. They're listening. So Kabam was listening. That's good. They've changed the reel up. They're, uh, they're like, okay, we're going to tease him with Hyperion now. Sauron, guys, I'm not that fussed over. Four star Tigra. There we go. There we go. All worth it. Totally makes sense, right? <laughs> All right, here we go. I don't even think that's a six star Hyperion that I'm seeing. I think that's like a four star. That is not teasing me. Yeah, four star Hyperion. Okay. Uh, I mean, that's better than nothing, right? That's better than nothing. I'd like you all to see something cool. We'll open that here at the end of this video. We'll open that up at the end of this video. I appreciate you all sticking around and the support you've been showing. That's our first six star too, out of all of these. That is the first six star. What are we at? We're at 54 crystals now. That was the first one. That was the first. go nope four star cat sam wilson i know some of you think he's really good i am not on board i have tested i've tried i've watched the videos uh nothing convinced me i mean he's good you can get things done with him don't get me wrong but he's not uh he's not moving his, his way up the rankings anytime let's uh, soon let's put it that way Black Bolts, Think, uh, speaking of someone who's going to be moving up the rankings, keep an eye for September's rankings. I've gotten some information, some insights, some high-level strategy, some game knowledge from a player who knows what they're talking about and really did, in all seriousness, really explain a little bit of why uh, they like Black Bolt, how you can be used. And I was like, that makes a lot of sense. We need to get that information out. So keep an eye out for that in September. Uh, all right, we got three left. We got three left. They're not even showing me Gallon anymore. <laughs> like, uh, okay, he's not even in the crystal. I, okay, this is good luck. I, I can't deny it. I cannot deny that that is good luck. So we'll open both of those, have some fun with it. Staron does nothing for me. So he does nothing. Nothing. All right, last one. Last one. Come on, we pulled Teddy on the final crystal. We can do this. We can do this. I know we can. Nope. Nope. All right. 
I didn't want to say anything. We're going to do one 10 pop desperation station, I believe is the term coined by Seton. We're going to pop these, then we'll do those six star uh, Nexus crystals. I hope we get them. Of course, that's the whole reason we're doing this. Let's see what happens. Let's see those two new. Let's see two new. Come on. Come on. Six stars do tend to travel in packs, but those are Nexus crystals. Yeah, this is not surprising. This is not a surprising result. This is just what we've seen over and over and over. Look at all those three stars, ladies and gentlemen. This is why you shouldn't do this. All right, let's go ahead and open up those six star Nexus crystals. Uh, you know, if we pull Hyperion, it'll put a little shine on this. It'll put a little shine on this for me, but uh, I would much rather have Gallon. I would much rather have Gallon. I, I, although I love Hyperion, he's incredible, he's amazing. All of those things. Uh, I'm not going to try to say that this was all worth it or some nonsense like that. Uh, Hyperion is great. Gallon is the one who I think is amazing for you now and definitely where it's headed. It is what it is. All right, we're going to spin this out because there's two of them. I'd still love to see Hyperion, though. It'll make me feel a little bit better. I feel a little bit better. Um, uh, Dragon Man. I really do like Dragon Man a lot. He's not someone I wanted to heavily invest SIGs into, but uh, six ones into, but his SIG ability is good, especially as you get it up there and against Cosmics, where it can really come into play. So that makes sense. I think it's doubled against Cosmics. You can get up to like a 75% or something like that, or 70% if I remember. So, all right. And then final one, would love to see Hyperion. Would love, love, love to see Hyperion. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I hope your luck was significantly better than mine. Take care. Oh, I went with it. Take care. I hope you either learned something, were entertained, or even better, a little bit of both. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Thanks so much for watching. Take care.